Green Burn. All right, you guys, we are here downtown Gresham. And apparently there's a car show going on today. Looks like there's a bunch of people out here right now enjoying it. Or at least what's going on already. But I think it's down a little bit from here. So let's go down here a bit and then I'll check back in with you guys. Look at this one, you guys. Right from the bat, this old Woody. That is beautiful. With the surfboards on top there. Oh, that is really pretty. Nice. That is awesome. Gosh darn it, with the wood. Surfboard ready to rock. That is gorgeous. I think there's some more down here, so let's go check it out. Usually, oh yeah, here we go. I was gonna say, normally these guys are parked back here in this little parking lot right off of Main Street. I think we're just now getting going. So let's go in here and take a peek, shall we? This is incredible so far. Look at this, you guys. With the flag going in the back there. We got the Chevy Super Sport Nova. Ooh, I like that. I like that color too. That is pretty. Yeah, I like that. That's bad. <laughs> I like that color a lot. It's pretty. Very nice. Howdy. <laughs> Look at this one, you guys. Wow. Holy smokes. Now that is, that is pretty. Look at those little things on the grill there. And that is low, man. That is a low rider. <laughs> that is pretty, pretty, pretty. Ooh, I love those fins. And then I got the blue, the blue dash. This thing is just shining right now. Look at these fins. Ooh, look at those fins with those tail lights. <laughs> wow. That is way cool. And then check it out. They even got the dice, the classic dice in the mirror. And it looks like their dash is all original too. Gorgeous. And I guess there's a whole row this side and that side. So I guess we'll start here. Wow, this thing looks like a mobster car. Holy smokes. The Roadmaster. They just don't really see them tubbed out like that with those. Oh, the Moonies, I think they call them. That is really pretty. Wow. Look at that, you guys. That is beautiful. I like the, uh, if you guys notice the little ripples in the bumper there, it's like a, I think it's called billet, the billet style. And the gas can with the, the round. Wow. And the classic, classic dash. I don't want to get too close because I want to be respectful to their, to their cars, you know. I don't want to, look at that. Look how small that windshield is. God, that is gorgeous, you guys. Get a shot here from the front. The Buick 8. And then right next to it here, we got this beautiful Falcon. God, that thing is really nice. That looks like a brand new coat of paint on that bad boy. And we'll get the front shot here too on this one. Oh, I like that. Ooh, with the sun gleaming off of that paint. That, that is pretty. That is pretty. It's almost like a candy apple with the original dash and dice as well. God, that's gorgeous. I just feel so spoiled right now with all these cars right now. This is incredible too. Check this one out. The racing stripes. That's beautiful. The classic. Oh, the out of the classic. Dash. Let me get a little better light. There we go. Ah, that's a great time for this right now. The rally sport. Oh, look at that. Uh, Look at the hood, how it swoops in there. Gets a good uh, good amount of air in there to really get it going. All right, here we go. Here's the front shot with the sun gleaming off of there. And then next door here, this is my 
favorite so far, I have to say. Ah, it's hard to choose. I don't know. That Impala is really beautiful, but this is incredible. We'll do the front shot here first. Hey, guys. Thanks so much for putting this on, you guys. This is incredible. It's the Historic Downtrack Parents and Business Association. Oh, okay. Part of Third Thursday, they wanted to get some cars. Heck, yeah. I used to do the Wednesday night show here for five years. I called somebody earlier, and they randomly answered. That was probably that was me. Was it? I said, hey, are you guys doing the show? And I said, it's not me that's doing it. Right. That was you, bro. That's so funny. I thought, I was like, I'm going to run into that guy. I do a, a YouTube blog. If you ever get bored, go on YouTube, type in The Creeper with a K. That's my channel. It's for everyone. It sounds kind of wackadoodle, but it's it's the good Creeper. He's like, get away from my car at this point. No, I'm just... It's the Creeper from Scooby-Doo, really, that they would like to mask at the end of the show. And Look at this. It's beautiful. Incredible. How those oh, they, yeah, they got the fenders off of it. That's a beautiful shot, you guys. Let's do the pull back from the original dash here. Wow, look at that, you guys. And then we'll do the pull away here. And I think we did, oh yeah, we started with the front shot here. Oh, look at the, look at the license plate. That's great. <laughs> Or not the plate, rather, the little, I guess it's considered still a plate, but I like that trunk on the back there. That's really cool. And then, of course, the back window. This is awesome. This is incredible. <laughs> and, uh, so far, I really did miss with you guys. Uh, then, uh, but look at how slow we are. So we got a whole other back lot here. Nice. Oh, look at the headlights on this. They kind of scoop out on the top. That is cool. Let's get the front shot here. I don't know, man. This is pretty good here. I have to say, this is a uh, this is a uh, tying there with the Impala. I don't know. It's a close call. What do you guys think? Make sure you guys chime in. Tell me what you think. And the Moonies. Ooh, very nice. Now I believe I could be wrong. The windows are one piece. It's an aftermarket thing. I could be wrong. But uh, look at that, the fender's tubbed out. Let's do the inside shot here with the dash. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, look at where the cigarette lighter is right up top there. That's interesting. Oh, wow, those seats are... Oh, so this has been totally customed in the inside too. With the littler steering wheel, that's really cool. Oh, and check this out for the antenna there. That is pretty. Man, with that light gleaming too. No, they. I had them buy. They got it in Reno. Oh, that's right. awesome, man. It's pretty pretty to have that built. But... All right, let's do the pullback yeah. here and check out this it's truck. Terrible. I thought that dog was real at first. <laughs> I was like, we got a dog in here too, but I guess it's just a prop. That's so funny. <laughs> you guys are awesome. He starts I'm barking gonna... then, and you're like, wait a minute. I'm thinking about getting a remote. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you should. Oh, a gal. Um, I caught up with her not too long ago on my channel. She had a '67 Mustang, and when she would honk her horn, or I think it was the alarm button, rather, it would do the horse, you know, the right, or yeah. whatever. I thought that was pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> hey, thanks for putting this on, fellas. Get the front shot here. That's a nice Chevy too. I like that color. And uh, I would do the inside here because I don't I don't want to interrupt, uh, get too close here. I want to be respectful. Next up here, I believe this is the 56 or 57 Chevy. This is incredible. Wow. And I think my dad actually owned one of these. What I really like about this car in particular is if you guys look closely here at the headlights, they kind of they kind of dip out. The fender kind of comes out over them. Let's get the front shot here. Nice, that's awesome. I think there's enough room here I can get by safely and get a shot of the interior as well. This is really pretty, wow. God, now that I saw this, I'm like, man, I don't know, it's a close call. This one might be it. Um, what do you guys think? Oh, it's the Bel Air, I'm sorry. Okay, I was off. But look at those tail lights. Look at those tail lights. Oh my God, those are cool. You just don't see those. It looks like he's got some custom work there done too on the paint. Let's get the back shot here. 
Ooh, now that is a car right there. I love those tail lights are custom. We got a Corvette here. This thing will get you off the line every time. This thing's bad. Look at the meaty. Look at those tires. This thing's ready to lay a nice patch. <laughs> It's like kit. You get the front shot here. Very nice. And then we'll pull away here. And this guy's got his dumped. This is pretty darn low. I believe it's a Pontiac. I could be wrong. Make sure you guys correct me if I'm wrong, of course, in the comments, because I might not just get the years, but the actual models. Here's the front shot of this guy. Look how low that is. I mean, that is so cool. And I think I might be able to. Oh, look at the buggy, you guys. All right, let's finish this. Look at the inside here. Ooh, he's got the shifter in there, too, that thing. Hall's butt. So check out this dune buggy, you guys. Volkswagen. This is really cool with the surfboards. Nice. Check out the plate, too, you guys. The surf's up. Crater Lake. Definitely miss my bug. Miss it, miss it, miss it every day. Had a 65. Look at those headlights, man. So cool. Man, that's a comfy one, too. Oh, he's got the MP short shift. That, that shifter right there, you can really go through the gears quick. And what's cool about that shifter is you can actually lift up and then pull, what is it, up and then back? Or no, I'm sorry, just up and back. Before, you had to press down, over, and then back on the bug. So that's pretty cool. You're going really good, but you're going slow. Oh, look at the look at the engine all chromed out, you guys. This is incredible. That look at those. I think they call those stingers, but he's got the dual stingers. Oh man, this thing. Oh, the dual, the dual 44s. I like that color a lot. Flag over the top here too. That's a nice shot. That is a nice shot. Right there. Surfboards on top. Look at this guy. You can hear his engine just purring. <laughs> Love that. Let's get another shot here from the front. And this is what I was talking about. This is this whole parking lot. And I think as the night, you know, gets a little darker and people start getting off work and stuff, there'll be a little bit more cars down here as well. So definitely cool. And uh, thanks again to the city of Gresham for putting this on this is uh definitely something that is really good for the city oh let's get this guy pulling in here that's nice listen to that guy purr wow that is beautiful oh look at this guy too man we really lucked out you guys that's cool. So I guess they're pulling in from over on this side. And if that's the case, I'll probably just set the camera up and watch them pull through. You guys were purring on the way in. Both of those sounded incredible. Nice. Look at this guy. She's pretty. Yes, she is. What year is, what year is yours, bud? 66. 66. Nice, dude. Oh, I got that scoop. I like that, man. Yeah. Heck yeah. Let's get the front shot here, too, guys. This guy was purring on the way in, though. Oh, yeah, right here. The SS. And I'm going to go ask this guy what year this is. Look at that cherry red. I definitely have to get a shot of this one. What year is yours, bud? 28. Wow. 28. Yeah, Holy. Thank you for me. <laughs> I don't blame you. Yeah, I don't think they'd even know what to do with this one. That's, that's a pretty one, man. That's a cherry red right there oh you got the wooden slat against the back there too what it's a it's a i'm sorry what year again 28 28 and what is the exact car roadster pickup roadster pickup very pretty man thanks so much for sharing your cars you guys that's so cool i was excited i'm walking down like wow i picked a good day to come out <laughs> thanks again bro for sharing look at that you guys he's got the wood slat oh look at that dash that is gorgeous. Wow. Oh, and the wooden, the wooden back here. Get the backside too. Oh, he's got the, the duels. And 
I like the custom Ford on the back too. That's pretty darn cool. Yep, all these guys came down here. And we got old Glory just flapping in the wind. It looks nice. That's slick, isn't it? That is nice. Oh, I was hoping he was gonna go the other way. That's okay, we'll catch him on the other side. had some folks here at the Historical Society, which I always love to come and see, right across the street from the the car show. Looks like we got a new a new statue too. This is really cool. Wow. Look at that. Hey. Looking dapper there. Mark, how you been? Awesome. I'm pretty darn good. We got a new statue in town, huh? Yeah, I have not. How new is that? About um, a month, just a little. Okay. Out. Well, I've been. I guess I've been hiding out, huh? I need to get my butt out more. That's cool. Yeah. Uh, was that by the uh, Sodenbergs? Um, this was done. Um, Heather Green. Oh, okay. Lives in, uh, oh, okay. Cool. Yeah, because uh, there's a gallery out in Troutdale too. But that's beautiful. Yeah. Very cool. What a nice spot for it too. Book author. Uh, Bruce Haney who wrote uh, Eccentric Tales of Boring Oregon. Oh, very cool. And um, we also have an artist, Helen Green. And, uh, very nice. She's going to be printing cards and uh, doing some neat stuff a little later. Very cool. I'll be taking the cover off of the, the Little Lending Library. Ah, good, good addition. Yeah. I like the statue too. I'm going to have to get a better peek here. Okay. Hey, nice to see you, Mark. Looking nice too, bud. Looking dapper. <laughs> Look at this, you guys. This is really pretty. What a great idea. Very lifelike too. Let's check out this. Uh, pardon me, guys. Sorry. Sunday at the Friday. The support from Joan Albertson, City of Gresham, Heather Green, GreenBras.com, Gresham Outdoor Public Art. So a brand new. Addition. This is so cool. What a nice day for this. Very cool. Right here in downtown Gresham. It's a nice addition here at the Gresham Historical Society. Mark's doing his. Do you do a vlog too? Do you do any social media, or I guess just for their for the page here, huh? I do Facebook. That's about as much as I do. For the for the historic. Okay, yeah, I'll leave it on there too this time. I think I have before actually. This That's is the fellow that uh, made the little library. Oh, nice. Nice. Good addition to the. Hey, good addition to the downtown area. You're the artist. No, he's. Oh, oh, okay. I haven't seen it yet, but I guarantee it'll be cool. That's awesome, man. Okay. <laughs> Are you ready? Are you ready? This is dedicated to all the community aggression from preschoolers to adults, and we hope it brings many hours of reading joy. Ready? And this is the man of the hour who made this happen. Yay! Actually, Mark and Julie made this happen. And Judy. <laughs> nice. What good people. Oh, that's pretty. Nice. That is a really nice one. Holy smokes. Oh, look at that. He's cutting the ribbon on it. That's it, you guys. Look at that. Yay! That was cool. Boy, that's a nice one. Oh, what? Look at that. These are the little bricks he's talking about, you guys. That's some serious detail right there. That's so cool. <laughs> Very cool. That's beautiful. There is. There's something up in the roof. Really? What? Is it a secret? So there is something up in the roof. Oh, cool. Very cool. 
nice. Very nice. And it was fun. Hands I down. Very um, nice. The point is, is, don't be afraid. You gotta, you know, go after it. Yeah. So anyway, that's all I'm gonna say. Okay. The design looks so good compared. I mean, it just matches it so Thank great. You. Yeah. It's so detailed. It's so detailed. Very pretty. What a nice thing. It does. It really does with the tiles. Turn out, you guys. This is cool. And I really like what they did next door today with the unveiling. That was nice. Pretty cool. That's going to do it for today. If you guys are new here, make sure you hit that thumbs up. You can also ring that bell. That way, when I creep, you guys will be the first to creep. If you didn't enjoy this particular vlog and you want to creep more, make sure you hit that red subscribe button down below. That'll make you an official creeper. <laughs> Boy, that's a mouthful. Anyways, creeper out for now. Peace. Look at this thing. <laughs> Hearst Caddy, four wheel drive. Wow. That's the zombie hunter. That is cool. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs>